All right, let's welcome to the show from House Judiciary Congressman Jeff Van Drew. Congressman, great to see you today. Thanks for being with us. This strikes me as a pretty big movement. Okay, uh, Chair Jim Jordan pulls back the contempt because he got some documents that say some pretty interesting things. What stands out to you about what uh, Chair Jordan released today? Well, what stands out is the fact that this is censorship, raw censorship, everything we don't want to see in America, literally taking away our freedom of speech. We knew it was true. You knew it was happening. But everybody, whether it was the FBI working with these social outlets or others, you know that there's stuff going on behind the scenes. What really is telling about this, though, and I'm glad that Zuckerberg finally turned it over, even though we had to be threatened to do it, and he should just get everything over to us. Mm. Lay it on the feet of where it belongs, which is the president of the United States was willing to take your freedoms away, your ability to speak, your ability to have an opinion, your ability to have a different idea just because he wanted to cram down everybody's throat what he thinks they needed to do. It was wrong. It, mm. It's just blatantly wrong. And it really speaks to whether we're going to keep our country free or not. That's how important it all is. I want to I want to shine a spotlight on one of Jim Jordan's tweets which reveals internal White House emails pressuring Facebook to censor posts. Jordan said, and this is in his tweet, we are facing continued pressure from external stakeholders, okay. including the White House and the press, to remove more COVID-19 vaccine discouraging content. Congressman, that statement, not surprising, we obviously saw that, but to see the internal documentation of the White House doing that, that strikes me as the kind of evidence that could really move the needle here. Oh, it can move the needle. You know, when you have a web of lies that gets so thick, and that's what's going on here, you get caught up in them. Whether it's Hunter Biden and all those issues, whether it's this issue, I mean, we have a president and a group around him that just continually and perpetually don't tell the American public the truth. And if there's anything that we have done in the House of Representatives and on the Judiciary and Oversight Committee is crack this foul mm. stinking egg open to really make sure that people know what the truth is and to make sure that we don't do this again. This is very important. This is like reading literally. Remember that George Orwell's 1984? Mm -hmm. it's, it's like reading it. Yeah, look, between whistleblowers, the emails we're seeing now, the threat of contempt of Congress, we are starting to get pieces of the story that were hidden before now. we got to leave it there. Thank you, Congressman Jeff Andrew, for being with us today. Thank you. It was a pleasure.